Well, he's been accused of being on the take. The city of Miami officer charged with providing protection to a cocaine dealer while in uniform remains locked up tonight. CBS 4's Gary Nelson live at the Turner Guilford Knight Correctional Center. And Gary, just how much trouble is this cop potentially in? He is in huge trouble. In fact, if convicted of the most serious charge against him, faces possible life in prison. In court today, the judge essentially called him one dumb cop. Two counts of armed cocaine trafficking. Miami police officer Jose Maldonado charged with trafficking in coke and taking bribes, wearing his badge in his marked Miami police car. Prosecutors say Maldonado took nearly $2,000 in cash payments at a McDonald's in Wynwood to stand guard for a dope dealer while the dealer did his deals. The dealer was a snitch, the buyer an undercover cop. Maldonado was in full uniform. Here's how a prosecutor described it. This is perhaps one of the most egregious breaches of trust, public trust. The state attorney says police have audio and video recordings of the cop arranging to provide the dealer protection, accepting the payoffs, standing guard at the McDonald's while the deals went down. Maldonado, a husband and father of two, lives in this complex in Pembroke Pines. No one was talking there, but the cop's lawyer was. He's up. He um, has faith in his innocence. I do too. And um, obviously, right now, it's, uh, it's a bit of a circus. Judge Jorge Rodriguez Shamat was not entertained, Maldonado, telling the allegedly counsel, crooked cop. All I can say is incredibly stupid. And this officer who put people in jail for seven years on the force won't be behind the wheel of a squad car anytime soon. One and two would be no bond. Three he remains seven, jailed, seven, held without bail. Five, and why no bail? Because armed trafficking in cocaine is a non-bondable offense. And when he was allegedly standing guard for this cocaine dealer, he was packing his department-issued 9mm Glock pistol. We're live in West Miami-Dade, Gary Nelson, CBS 4 News. Gary.